Hi guys, welcome back to another studio vlog. It's Monday right now and I've just been doing sort of admin stuff all day so I've not had much to talk to you about so far. I have some more albums to make today and I also need to pick some artwork for the new releases. So I've got an idea of one kit, it's gonna be a Valentine's Day themed kit and I'm not sure what the other theme will be for this week but I'm just gonna look through artwork and see what I like. So onto the albums. Morning guys, um, it's actually like nearly 12 p.m. Um, but I thought I would update you. I've been trying to find some clip art because I've got my Valentine's Day set, but I really wanted a winter set and I was struggling to find any art at all that I liked. Um, I think I've got one now, so fingers crossed I can make a really nice kit out of it. I designed the Valentine's Day one last night, so I'll show you a clip of that over this. I actually just had my food shop delivered an hour early, which was really good. Um, the guy said he was like he messed up on the timings, but that suits me fine. I got a new toy for Ari, it's like a sprout, um, it squeaks, but he's already ruined it because it's got like leaves on it that were like kind of flappy um, and he just chewed them right off. So I've cut the rest off and hopefully the sprout bit like lasts a bit longer. It's like a solid ball, um, but yeah, he doesn't do well with soft toys. I'm gonna get to designing that new kit and then I'll show you what I come up with. This is the wintry art that I found, but I'm really struggling for this last box. Like, I, I just don't know what to use. I've, all the clip art I've got left is like, I just don't know what to, because I don't want to use the Chanel thing or like the Ugg boot, like the stuff with um, like brand names on it because of like copyright infringement. But I just don't know what to do. Oh, I hate when I'm stuck on just one box. So I ended up adding a quote and just moving two boxes around a little bit. And I think it looks really cute. So I'm happy with this collection. Not sure what to name it yet, but yeah, I'll finish the rest of the kit and then I can get to printing. I just thought I would check in. I don't think I've got much footage today or yesterday, um, but I have just had dinner, did Zumba, um, I cleaned the office a little bit and like tidied a few things around. Um, I reorganised my shelves, you can't really see that well, but I added a plant because I felt like that side of my room is kind of lacking like nature. Um, <laughs> I just thought it would look nicer with a plant and like greenery and stuff. So I've done that. I was thinking about actually making some large albums like just for the photos this week. I think in the last vlog I said I wasn't going to do it yet because of like not having time. But if I get my new releases cut tomorrow I probably will have time, especially if I only make a handful. Um, so I might do that. So if I don't do that the only other thing I can think to do this week that needs like immediate attention is to make the Lucky Dip kits ready for Black Friday because that's like a job that I will definitely procrastinate and then it will get to like the Wednesday of Black Friday week and I'll be like 
oh I've said there will be lucky dip bags and there were not any so lucky dip kits are collections that were in the shop and now discontinued um, and then customers can buy them at like a highly reduced rate but the catch is they don't know what they're getting it's like a mystery pull um, hence the lucky dip so I need to prepare those. The sale will begin on a Thursday, so I don't know why I'm boring you with all this information. <laughs> Not this early anyway. Um, the sale always begins on a Thursday evening, so Thursday and Friday are just like new releases and the discount. Saturday is normally the grab and oops bags. Sunday is normally a day I struggle with, so if you have any suggestions, anything you'd like to see on a Sunday <laughs> that you think I could like pull out of the bag, please let me know. Um, and then Monday I have like a special surprise in store for Cyber Monday so I'm pretty much sorted it's just like nailing down all the details anyway that was like a huge information dump now I'm gonna make the cut files for that last kit I designed um, get it started printing and then hopefully do a little bit of cutting I'll catch up with you in the morning so one thing I meant to show you I went around my office and collected a few things that I thought would make good props so I've got loads of these fluffy bows. These were from Shameless Stickers. Um, so I've got these in like a variety of colours. Um, I've got a few other random paper clips. So this one was from Cherry Blossom in the Market Square. Um, a Once More With Love Munchkin one. Whoops. Um, miscellaneous things. I've got loads of highlighters. These are just the pastel ones that I think would work well. Um more paper clips I've got these scissors that are like rose gold and I don't know if this is how they're meant to be it looks like the Eiffel Tower like do you see that like is is it meant to be is it designed that way I've always wondered <laughs> um, I have a pretty paintbrush from Betty Hayways and it is a super pretty like duochrome uh, metal I don't know what this part is called but the metal bit I've got a few pens, so this one has a crystal, I think Becca got Becca got me that pen, and then I think this is a Kiki K one, the gold one, and this is a pen gems, and then this is a Foxy Fix mouse mat, which I just shoved in here because I'm sure like a leather pink thing would look good in the background so yeah this is what i thought i would gather up just ahead of taking the photos so that i've got a few options to grab for Wednesday. I'm just about to get my day started. Um, I need to finish cutting today and then at 4pm I need to take the rabbits to the vets for their just like annual vaccinations. I do want to film another office tour because my last one was like hmm, maybe like two years ago. No, a year and a half I think because we moved into this house two years ago next month and then I think I filmed it in the spring. So I was thinking about getting an updated office tour filmed to upload the week of Black Friday because although I will vlog Black Friday week it's probably going to be a long vlog and I might not get it edited in time especially like because there will be Black Friday going on so I think I'm going to try and do that either today or tomorrow I might do it tomorrow in the morning so I've got like good natural light but yeah my main goal for the day is to get the releases cut um, I didn't actually do any yesterday I caught up in my planner a little bit because I'm still like two weeks behind but at least I've done some of last week um, I'm going to try and do this week like as the week happens then I only need to catch up on one previous week but I realised because I'm doing the vlog 
I can sort of look at the vlog and see what I did rather than like normally if I'm memory planning and I haven't written anything down I like scroll through messages with people and see what I told them I did um, which is kind of annoying so I'm going to try and work out what I did from the vlog Hi guys, I just thought I would give you a little update um, I am actually at the vets now um, it's all very like covid safe we have to park in like numbered bays and then when you get here you have to ring reception and they come and collect your animals from you in the car park um, so Tallulah and Enzo are at their vaccination um, it's actually really good because normally what happens for the rabbits is they have one vaccination now and then I think in two weeks they have to come back and have like the other vaccinations but he's just let me know that there's actually a new vaccine where they do it all in one go so that's great so we've only got to come once sorry about this weird angle I've never vlogged in the car and I was imagining like having to hold the camera but there's quite a lot of people around me so I thought I would just like prop it up and then look slightly less inconspicuous so I've cut the full kits the wintry one and Halloween Halloween the wintry one and the valentine's day one um i need to do the mini kits when i get back um but i'm making good progress also went on a little walk with ari uh, we got caught in the rain <laughs> so that was great and that's about all i have to update you on just waiting for the rabbits to come back and then i have to ring reception and pay and then it's back home so i guess i'll catch up with you with some work related stuff in a bit Please ignore my hair, it is hair wash day and it's not like completely dry so I've not scrunched the gel out yet. Um, anyway, <laughs> I've just finished cutting the new releases, um, I need to put them into the cello bags because I ran out. So I had to go and get some more from the garage. Um, I did show you a few little clips of the garage, it's where I keep most of my um, like bulk buy supplies. So things that I buy in huge quantities, so like cello bags, paper, envelopes, packaging material, stuff like that. Um, but it's a big mess, so I just showed you like a small clip. So today I need to take listing photos and do the new release listings and stuff, but I think I'm going to have a break from that and do some albums. So like I made the small albums last week, I'm going to go through my large album files and decide which albums I want to keep in the shop as a permanent range. Um, and then print and cut just a few of those so that I can make up some for photos. I also have a drawer of like album leftovers. So like when I make the albums, there's three stickers. Sometimes like one sticker will misfit. So then I end up taking from another album sheet and end up with two spares, if that makes sense. Um, so I'm going to go through that and see what I already have made up and then just make up the extras to finally use up the like leftover album sheets. Um, the drawer is full. <laughs> So uh, I don't do this very often because it is quite like time consuming going through and seeing what you have rather than just printing the same amount of each. But if I can do that I will save on some materials because I can use up the leftovers. And one more thing I need to do today is go and order some more grey bags from Royal Mail. My friends said they were having like supply issues um, and they were struggling to get grey bags out to people. So especially in the lead up to Black Friday. Um, how many times do I say Black Friday? in like a video, it must be like 10 times. Drink every time I say Black Friday. <laughs> um, yeah, so in the lead up to Black Friday, I'm gonna make sure that I've definitely got enough great bags, so I'm gonna order some in advance. So I think I'm gonna go and make a coffee and then crack on with the albums.
So I had way more than I thought. I've got this big pile of mini stickers that are all prepped, like they're all ready to go and I just didn't put them on albums. Um, these are my spare small albums, so I'm not going to use those today. These are spines mostly. Um, these are the ones I'm going to go through and like prep, I guess. Um, these are, what even are these? Small albums. And then ones that I don't, these are oops that shouldn't have been in there. These are reusable albums. Um, and these are more minis. Uh, basically, I, I thought I would just have like this many in total and there's so many. So, I mean, I guess it's good because I've got less to make, but oh my God, why? Why have I always had so many leftovers? The more Black Friday swaps arrived today. I've got three envelopes. So I'm gonna show you what I've received. These ones are from Handmade Mommy Plans. She sent me a cute note just saying thank you for swapping. And then she sent these little rainbow stickers. They're so cute. Oh, my camera just died. <laughs> so from Triple Threat Planner, I have these like musical theme stickers, which is so cool. She sent a little note that says um, she has a career in the performing arts, which is so cool. Um, so that was from Triple Threat Planner. And then from my friend Joanne at Josephine Bow Designs, got these pink and green samplers and Joanne's tree was always the cutest so I really love those. done the photos for the new releases so that is good i hate leaving it to the last minute so i'm glad i did it sort of in the evening rather than at night sorry about ari squeaking <laughs> Good morning guys, happy Friday. Um, I've just made like the biggest coffee. <laughs> I've filled this cup, I don't know if you can see, um, but normally this cup has like, when I make a normal coffee, it fills like halfway. So I was like, I'll just double it. Now I'm probably gonna be like overdosed on caffeine. But anyway, the plan for today is to finish off the large albums. And by finish, I mean cut and produce them. <laughs> because I really didn't get much done yesterday. And there is a kit I want to design. I saw the artwork yesterday and it's basically what I was looking for all of this week. Um, it's like wintry and really cute. So I'm gonna get that kit designed and I would like to finish the Black Friday freebies just so they're out of the way and I can get the photos and the promotional pictures done. We're at that point now where I need to be squeezing in like extra Black Friday prep in the weeks in the lead up to Black Friday. Um, and I've only got two weeks. It's Friday the 13th of November today. <laughs> Ugh. Well, November is not the weird part. It's the Friday the 13th. <laughs> That's the weird part. I'm not really superstitious. My favourite part about Friday the 13th is like tattoo shops that do like Friday the 13th flash. Uh, I think it's really cool. I haven't had a tattoo in years though. Anyway, that was my Friday morning ramble. I'm going to do a little bit of social media scheduling because I didn't do that yesterday. Oh, hi friend. Hi, you can say hi to the vlog. I am waiting for a package from Marks and Spencers, but it's like presents for Christmas for other people. So it's not really anything that I would show on the vlog. I was thinking about doing like a little Christmassy vlog. Um, Becca asked me to do like a getting ready for Christmas vlog. Um, and I was thinking I could just do like, like Christmas baking, wrapping, decorating the tree. Cause although we put the tree up, we haven't decorated it. Um, so it's like completely not shop related, but I know people love Christmas, so. 
I thought it might be fun. I think I'm going to just film like a few clips over the next like few weeks and then just put it all together into one vlog. Right, I'm going to do some work and drink my coffee before it gets cold. So this is the Aurora collection. This is the wintry kit I was telling you about. It's so pretty. I'm so happy with how this kit turned out. I just think it's the most lovely winter kit and then you've got like kind of the neutral colours with a green and a pink. Also look at the small board, like how dreamy is this? I've made one of each of these album designs and restocked a few of each. Um, so I've got the Lily one. This one is called Peace. And these are the large albums, by the way, so they fit kits and half sheets. This is Celestial. This is Bow. I don't know why they're all upside down. <laughs> um, this is Christmas Jumper. This is Sparkle. This one is a Petal, Peach Dream, named by Cat. shout out to Cat. <laughs> this one is Ice Cream, oh, one the right way up. This is Nebula, Bloom, Marble Swirl, Fleur, Mauve Rose, Sunflower, Planner Desk or Planner Love and then this one is Planner Desk. So the large albums are done. They'll be in the shop um, probably by the time you see this vlog. Um, I've only restocked a few of each just because I need to make them for the photos and it will take me a much longer time to do a large restock but I do plan to do one in the near future. I didn't vlog that much today. Um, I've got a sore eye, this one. It's like just kind of painful. I don't know what I've done with it. I've taken my contacts out, so I've just got my glasses on. It's not like super painful, but it's just been like, I've been aware of it all day and it's just been like uncomfortable. So yeah, I think I'm gonna end the vlog here. Uh, thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed this week's studio vlog. I feel like it's kind of lacked structure. I think I filmed just sort of lots of little bits and it doesn't really like fit together seamlessly, but I haven't checked the footage, so who knows? We might have a good vlog or we might just have like a random one. But anyway, I'm gonna sign off here so I can get the vlog edited for Sunday. Please like and subscribe if you did enjoy the video. Thanks again for watching and I'll see you next week for another studio vlog. Bye.